how to add placeholder text in contact form 7. In this video session, I'm going to show you how simple it is to add placeholder text or information for contact form 7. We are looking at a sample contact form 7 on my valued client's website. My valued client offers pest control services in Mississauga in Canada. So, as we can see, there is no placeholder text. All you need to do is when you log into your dashboard and find contact form 7 that you'd like to add it and add placeholder text to, what we'll do is let's do this. I'll zoom in so that you see. Anywhere past the, the form tags that you've created and want to add placeholder text to, just type placeholder, put a space, double quote, and type in any message that you'd like to add. So while here, let's just grab this, copy paste so it's much easier. Let's say email, let's just say hello at example.com just to guide the, the visitor and let's say for this just placeholder double quote type your message here three dots let's close the double quote now let's remove this here so i'll zoom in so that you see what just happened to add a placeholder all you need to do is mention the word within the form tag that you've created and then have a space in between then double quote and then placeholder message and then close the double quote within the brackets so now let's update as in save the contact form and then let's refresh this web page. Let's refresh and now that is our placeholder. But as you can see, maybe it's smart for us to grab the subject and also the message and place them in placeholder information as well. So let's do the subject, grab that. And while here, let me pass on website optimization insights for you. And that is to say, when you create any type of contact form on your website, ask yourself this simple question. Do I really need the field that you've created? As in, in this example, do we really need the subject for this particular website yes we do okay so what I'm trying to say to you is always simplify the user experience that you're offering on your website that includes the contact form fields and try to simplify the the user interaction makes sense because people on internet especially on websites they are always pressed for time and they want things done quick so let's go back to adding a placeholder text as we now know we've just removed the subject and message as well and right now you can see it is much more simpler and much um, less cluttered so to speak so this is how you add a placeholder information within contact form 7 all you need to do is edit the form that you've created and then place the word placeholder put a space and then double quote your message then close the double quote and then you'll have your placeholder text furthermore keep in mind rank your blog has contact form 7 how to's whereby i'll show you great insights for optimizing contact form 7 including styling it 
and making it much more visually appealing for your website visitors. And I'll talk with you in the next video session.